Good morning, I am Pastor Jason. Welcome to the Pastor's Corner. Today I want to talk to you about the subject of living for the glory of God. And uh, in Jesus in John 9 verse 3 said, Neither this man nor his parents sinned, said Jesus, but this happened so that the work of God might be displayed in his life. The question that was asked of Jesus was, who sinned, this man or his parents that brought about this blindness in his life? Uh, Jesus' answer to the question was that not all human suffering is a, the purpose of human suffering is not always a punishment for sin, but it can be seen as a wonderful opportunity for God to do his work in the lives of people. And no matter what problems people may be having today, it is not uh, merely a punishment for sin. It is a wonderful opportunity for them to turn to God and experience His power at work in their life. So that they may have a story to tell that the ultimate result is to bring glory to Him. So whatever tragedies we experience in our life, instead of seeing it uh, in a negative way of a punishment for sin, we can see it as an opportunity to turn to God, to trust in Him and that He might work His power, His love in our lives, that we may experience Him and tell the world of what He has done in our lives. In the end, the blind man's story was, I was once blind, but now I see. And that was for the glory of God, for the glory of Jesus Christ. Because once His life was a tragedy, but now it turned out to be a victory, all because He encountered Jesus Christ in His life. Today, your tragedy can turn out to be a victory and it can be all for the glory of God. We should live, brethren, we should live for the glory of God and our life should be a living testimony about His work that has taken place in our lives that brings glory to Him. Today, I want to tell you and challenge you that no matter what trial you are going through, instead of looking negatively about what, why this has taken place in your life, turn to God, trust in Him. Lean on His strength, His power, His love and let Him show you His goodness in your life that will give you a story to tell the world about what Jesus Christ has done for you. Live for the glory of God. Trust in the Lord. Trust in His love. His power. God bless you. Have a wonderful day.